There's some cute symmetry in the fact that both the OPEC meeting and the European Central Bank rate setting meeting happen in Vienna this week. The OPEC meeting is likely to be more fun, if that's the word, thanks to the new style and direction of the new Saudi delegates. By contrast, the ECB will lack drama, but let's be careful not to use the B word. The last time everyone expected a meeting to be boring, it ended up with a sprinkling of confetti by a protester for President Draghi. In fact, while no one is expecting a shift in policy from the ECB this week, the press conference will be anything but dull, thanks to the recent jump in the price of oil. The black stuff has bounced back hard since it hit a 12-year low in January. Since January, it's up by nearly 80%. Between the March ECB meeting and the cut-off point for the staff projections that will be released this week, it's up by 20%. That's not something the ECB can or will want to ignore in its inflation forecasts. Higher forecasts are a distinct possibility on Thursday, and in fact some investors reckon there's a case for raising inflation forecasts over 2% for 2018. Over 2%, that's above the target. Most likely it'll be tempered a bit, but still there's a good and rare chance that Mario Draghi could bring an unusually upbeat tone to proceedings on Thursday. That's a balancing act. Too downbeat and everyone will wonder what the point of all this monetary stimulus is after all. Too optimistic and critics may say it's time to reel it in. We'll likely get a message that there's jam tomorrow only if the taps are turned on full blast, as the last thing anyone needs right now is a fresh rally in the euro.